It feels like an intergalactic cult. Every single piece that we make always asks questions. And so it's always about how we're going to answer the next challenge that the pieces have kind of laid out for us. I studied jewellery for five years in total. I did three years of a degree and then two years of a master's. And I studied sculpture for two years before that. In that process, the whole thing that I was really interested in was like how we build relationships with objects and how we sort of form attachments to things. I wanted to make things that had different layers to them and different qualities so that as you wore them over time, different things became revealed. What we do here is create and sculpt the wax pieces around the stones and then cast those pieces with the stones in place directly into the molten gold. And in a lot of ways, that means that the stones have the opportunity to move around and shift and get buried and find their own place within the piece. I think it makes them super tactile and inviting and engaging in a way that gives them a warmth and a human quality that I really love. I've never been a great lover of super shiny, perfect jewellery. It never really spoke to my heart. And when I would put people's rings on, I'd look at my hands in those rings and it just didn't, it just didn't match up. The community here is so great. I never thought I'd end up in LA. I never thought that I'd end up with this team of amazing people that I work with. As the jewellery started to grow, as the brand started to grow, it became really clear that I wasn't going to be able to do it all by myself. And James started off by becoming a full-time parent. Six months in, he said, why don't I do your casting? And so he trained himself to be a caster. I don't see my name as being my name anymore. It's Lucy and it's Ben and it's James and it's Leah and it's everybody that puts their love and energy into the work. You want to come on the journey? Let's go on this journey. I don't know where it's going to take us. We're still on the ride.